Good morning, this is Eddie from the Wilderness Twins. How are you doing? Right, been asked to, uh, one of my subscribers has asked me to show the watering system that I use. Um, I don't use um, bottles with the, the nipples on them. I used to, um, but I decided coming up to winter, I would take those off because I knew that those were probably going to freeze because we've got temperatures down at like um, nighttime, it's like minus 11, minus 14 Celsius. So temperatures way down there. So those nipples would freeze real easy. Um, these are the, the trays I use. It's uh, an aluminum, pressed aluminum. It looks like a, a surgical kidney dish with just that, that bit at the back. Um, all you have to do um, is cut out a hole two inches square. But let me take you down and I'll show you in two seconds. Okay, this is the um, kidney dish when it's installed into the cage. Um, these wee guys have just been weaned. These are Charlotte's babies. Um, so they're now six weeks old. Um, so as you see, there's a square cut off right around here. So because this is an inch square, you just cut off the four pieces and that's your two inch square. You'll then pull this bit through and then, let me get this. Oh. And then these parts here, you bend these down and around the wire. Um, that clips it onto the wire and makes it secure that it's not going to you know, fall off. Uh, the way it's used, I'll just take this bottle off for now, is you put obviously the bottle in this part as you've seen. Um, the beauty of these is if it's if they get dirty, um, there's food in it, or you know the, the rabbits have been all piling over the food, sort of defecated in it or whatever, then it's easy to clean. Just get a bucket, and it tips up. Nice. It's what a simple method. Tip that back, and I use any pop bottles. The liter pop bottles are to me the best. Um, I've tried looking at the um, two liter. But you, when you put them in, it, the, I don't know if it's, these are heavy, a little bit more heavy duty, um, but when you put the two liters in, it sucks it in. It's like the, uh, creates a vacuum. But what it is, you pour that in, pull it, you know, just like um, dogs, you know, you'll get these dog bottles and stuff at home. It'll get to a certain level where the water is level with the lip of the bottle, and then it'll stop pouring. So as it's drinking, then that will just pour down um, until it's empty. Um, these are usually filled up, you know, twice a day. Um, I have had trouble with the bottom ones freezing and when it's really cold before I got my new heater, which I'll show you in a second. Um, but since then, since I've had my heater, there's only the one bottle right at the back of the, um, that ever freezes. And that's only just crystallization on the, the top. I've never had a problem with the, the heating since then. Um, but that's the watering system that I use. Um, so hopefully, you know, it's some information for you to whether you want to use your own. Like I got these at um, Grand River, Grandview River, oh, I can't remember the name of it now. Um, I'll put the link down there. Um, but they're, they're like $2. You know they're really cheap um very good way of being able to to water your your rabbits that way you don't have to go inside pick up water boat you know bowls and stuff in the winter time simple way love it okay talk to you later bye for now